I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Dr. Martin Luther King. I'm going to take three fingers from the top in the center and put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw an oval. And at the bottom of the oval on the left hand side, I put one little straight line on the left and one little straight line on the right. I go back to the left and I connect the two with a slightly curved line. I come right here in the center and I draw a straight diagonal down, straight line up, leave a space, straight diagonal down, straight line up. I'm going to add one baby circle, two baby circles. In the center I'm going to draw a curved line and on the left hand side I draw a curved line down, up, connect, and I am going to come on the left hand side right here and draw a curved line down to the uh, end of the paper Come on the right hand side, draw a curved line down to the end of the paper. I come back up on this section and I draw a straight diagonal down, in, out, in, down on the left. I come on the right hand side, I draw a straight diagonal down, straight line in, straight diagonal out, in, all the way down to the bottom of the sheet. Right here, I'm going to put a little straight line and a baby circle. Straight line, baby circle. Straight line, baby circle. Straight line, baby circle. And right about here on the left, I put a straight line going down. And on the right, I put a straight line going down. I come back up to the top and I draw a curve line out. In, connect on the left. Curve line out and connect on the right. I'm going to come up on the left. I'm going to draw a slightly curved line on the left, slightly curved line on the right. I go back to the left and I'm going to add a circle. And on the right, I'm going to do the same thing. Right above, I'm going to add a slightly curved line, slightly curved line on the uh, right. In the center, I draw a curved line over stop and now I'm going to do little straight lines all the way across from left to right. I'm going to add just a slight curved line and now I'm going to do his hair and I just do a little wavy 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 line all the way across. Keep going. Put a little bit underneath on the left and a little bit underneath on the right. There's Dr. King. Let's see what he looks like all colored in. Okay, I'm going to color in his face lightly with brown. Don't forget his ears. Don't forget his neck. I'm going to leave his shirt white, but I'm going to come in and I'm going to color in his suit black, both sides lightly, not so dark that you lose your drawing. And I'm going to come in and I'm going to do his tie. First I'm going to draw some green stripes with my green crayon. And then, just add a little bit of color. And then, <clears throat> I'm going to come back in and I'm going to color in between the green stripes with a gray crayon. Just to give it a little bit more color. Once I'm done with that, I'm ready to use my black crayon and color in his hair. And don't forget the little part down here at the bottom. Okay, there's Dr. King. Let's see what he looks like totally colored in. Here's Dr. King all colored in, ready to give his speech, I Have a Dream. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>